Hey YouTube, it's Demetri, and today we're going to talk a little bit about uh, valuations here, a course that is coming up, which I thought many of you might find interesting or helpful. Um, if you're a part of anything like the FRM, you need continuing education credits. This is an awesome opportunity to do this. Um, if you work in the valuation space at all, this is very, very pertinent to you. It's looking at cash flows, timings, um, and the more generalized equation of all the equations we learned in traditional finance, which are then also used in quantitative finance for valuations and pricings as well. Um, so David Shimko, good friend of mine, um, is putting this course on. Again, there's a link in the description below. It is an affiliate link, meaning I am part of this. I'm excited. I think this is a really good opportunity here. Uh, I've heard this presentation twice now. This is pitched at the Quaint Quant Conference. Um, but this is gonna be a more in-depth version of this. It is two hours and 15 minutes. Um, it is June 21st. It is from 9 a.m. to 11.15 a.m. Eastern Standard Time, so New York City time. Um, it is $110 for the course, for the registration here. If you're at a company, often you get your company just to sponsor it and pay for it. Um, it's again, it's continuing ad. It's related to you, typically your designations. Um, but it's the most beautiful equation in finance. Um, I think this is quite interesting and quite unique, to be honest with you guys. I've spent, those of you know, I have a four-year undergrad degree in finance and economics, uh, and then I went on later to study applied economics and financial engineering. Um, but I went through all these typical frameworks, right? So we look at like a generalized CAPM model, uh, forwards and futures, options, discrete and continuous time for their pricing of that, uh, looking at private valuations, all tying this into the CAPM, the capital asset pricing model, um, I've heard this presentation again multiple times here. I'm really excited for this. Uh, but it makes you think differently about how there is one generalized equation that everything falls into. So everything you've been taught for these is more or less a specialized case of this. Why I think this is a good presentation and a good use of your time is because it will help open up the way you think about it in the process of how you go through valuations here, right? It's often easy to get kind of boxed into this is the standard approach, this is how I do it, this is how it makes sense, and you justify it and you use it. But if you can look at things more generalized from a generalized perspective, um, it is often more helpful. Um, and pricing things that are a little bit more complex or unique or you have some sort of issue that you're running into and you can't figure out how to solve it. Um, again, I've heard this presentation a few times and every time I hear it, it makes me think about it a little bit differently, right? I don't work in the valuation space per se, but I do work with discounting cash flows and timing and looking at risk. Again, all pertinent to this, but through a different lens here within typically the large banking space um, on the credit side of this. And so now I'm starting to like think like, how can I apply this? How can I use this to solve more complex problems here? Um, again, the event is going to be online. It is live. So you have to be there. Uh, again, it is June 21st. Registration deadline is June 20th um, at 2100 hours. So military time there, Eastern time. Um, but I think it's a great use of your time if you're looking to learn more about the valuation side of this. Um, again, I will put this little caveat in there. So just, you know, students that have no experience don't necessarily sign up and then are disappointed with this. Um, there's a little kind of an audience disclaimer here at the bottom that students should have prior courses or practical experience covering present value. So discounting cash flows, uh, the cap M and derivatives. Students will not only find a common basis for these pricing models, they will also become exposed to advanced valuation concepts useful in solving practical valuation problems. If you're interested, follow the link below, um, sign up. If you guys do attend, I'd love to hear your feedback on it as well, right? I have my own opinions. I've seen it. Um, and I'd love to see those that are in different areas of valuations, cash flows, pricings, modeling, derivative pricing, for example. Um, what did you think of it? How good was it? Has it changed the way you thought about it? Or is it more or less just kind of like a, yeah, that makes sense. Because every time I've listened to it, I'm like, okay, I think I, I get it, it makes sense. But then it's kind of eye-opening that it's a bit more generalized than I would have expected, which I think is kind of unique here and helps me solve problems a little bit differently. So love to hear your thoughts and opinions in the comments below if you do attend. Uh, thanks for listening, thanks for watching. And as always, until next time. Hey.